Hey, good morning. Hercules is having a morning tweet session. Hopefully that's okay because there's no stopping a tweet session once it starts. Um, I'm sure everyone is aware of that. I have a few goals for this month. I just woke up and we're getting started already. Why not? You know, the earlier the better. I want to make a video every week this month. Cheers to that, guys. Um, let's see if I can do it. Who freaking knows? Also, going to update my shop at the end of the month, so I'm going to prep for that and run my Patreon, and those are my goals. The biggest goal, really? No. I don't know. Is it the videos or the shop update? You decide. Right now, I am going to put together postcard sets, and then I'm gonna put together my little mini sticker sets, which you'll see later in the video. I'm gonna tear it up, okay? So I'll see you there. I can't wait. I'm just basking in this little spot of sunlight. Thanks. I just dropped a whole box of postcards, which is nothing new here, guys. Drop literally everything I touch. Woohoo! I'm a klutz! Time. A little bit of Princess Diaries. All the way back on it, but you get it. <laughs> I sorted all the postcards and inventoried them. So they're all here, stacked. Some of them got bagged from my leftover bags I had from my last order of sketchbook postcards. So I just need to order some more of these little envelopes to put them in and we can package all those. All those. Next, I'm going to sort my mini red sticker sets, which were a huge hit with my last shop update. They look kind of like this, but that'll be fun. It, it's kind of time consuming and I have to order bags for that. So it's just time consuming work that is completely brainless. So that's why I'm watching Princess Diaries, you know what I mean? Um, that was gross. Anyways, um, hoping to get all of these stickers sorted today and I need to put in an order for the sketchbook envelopes, the sticker envelopes. I can inventory some of my stuff from my last shop update, so. I can be prepared with my numbers because I'm not always good about that, okay? So she's not perfect. I'll see you later. And I freaking forgot. This isn't even a freaking moment, but I used it. I forgot that I actually changed some of the designs slightly. Let me show you. This is gonna be fun. So the old one, this is the packaging I, I use. It's a recyclable glazing envelope with some washi tape and that's it. Uh, so the old set looks like this. Let me put it on my desk and not hold it up. I don't know why I insist on holding stuff up in front of the camera like that. It's just absolutely nuts that I do that. So this was the first version of the red sticker set, which I think is cute, but this yellow background came out so strong and I just, especially on this one, I didn't like it very much. Um, I think it's kind of okay there, but it doesn't make the set cohesive. 
Luckily these kind of went together. So I wanted to make the background all this color for every sticker. Because this background is white. I don't know why I did that. And this one's a little darker. I'm not sure if I adjusted that. So let me get out the new ones. Oh, I did adjust it. Very cool of me. I don't think I did anything to this one. Here's the new strawberry. The raccoon, which came out a little lighter than the first print. And then I completely took out the yellow on the bunny. And this looks weirdly smaller, like way smaller, which is stupid, whatever. So this is the old and the new set. I still don't love the yellow and I took it completely out of this one. So that's the only one with yellow, which is kind of weird. But I am happy with the change on this one. And I think they look a little more cohesive here with the similar background color. I don't know if you can really tell on camera, but I literally just started sorting these stickers. Like I, I just started over there, see that? Um, realizing that I shouldn't be sorting them because I can't sort these right now because you need the envelope to package them after they're sorted into sets of five. Because like, if you just got a stack of these stickers and just keep stacking them like the postcards, it's not helpful. So, didn't think that through. I'm gonna have to do that once I get the baggies that they go in. So, I guess I'll, um, what shall we do? Shall we inventory? Man, do I, I don't wanna do that. I guess I will eat, yuck or I can order, um, reorder some prints. So maybe I'll do both. Hey, same spot, same day, what's up? I just inventoried all my stickers, which is good, so I can reorder some that are low and update my website so it's ready when my shop update's going. I still need to inventory some of my prints and then inventorying will be over, then I just need to work on stocking it back up, whatever is low. Um, but now I'm going to design a sticker. It's going to be Halloween themed or at least spooky themed. I'm gonna use a ghost design I did a couple weeks ago and clean it up and make it into a sticker um, so I can have something Halloween-y to sell in my shop update because I love Halloween stuff and it needs to be done. Plus one of my patrons requested something Halloween-y so I will gladly fill that request. So I'm gonna do that today. I want to make all the lines even. Like they have different line density in this drawing and I wanna make them all the same, I think. Um, I like the coloring and I think I'm gonna do Fear Me but I'm not gonna do a speech bubble. I think I'm gonna do maybe like an arch of text over his head. Maybe integrate some like stars or like mag magical twinkle stars or something around him. So we'll see. Um, that's the plan. Let's see if I actually follow it. started this video when I woke up and I was like, I'll get ready for the day. And look at me now, still in my pajama shape. But I um, was just organizing some stuff in here because this whole room is not organized at all. Because you know, I just moved in and am busy. I'm so busy, you know? But I found little envelopes that I put the red stickers in so I can sort out some of those if I want. Too bad I just ordered just enough for my new stickers I ordered. 
nailed it. But right now I'm gonna take down this recycling pile that's been in my studio for minimum one month. If we're being honest, that's it, because that's as long as I've lived here, so one month. Um, you're gonna bring that down. Hopefully our recycling bin isn't all the way full because this will fill it. If you're wondering why I have four guitars in here, I don't know. They're James's. And they're... I don't play guitar. So I'm sassy about that for no reason. I just want, want you to know I don't play guitar. Woo, I'm excited to get it out of here and keep organizing because I'm realizing with this shop update, I'm going to need my stuff in places where I know where it is slash organized to work. So add that to the list, buddies. Bye. Hello, welcome to Wednesday, the next day since you last heard from me. Right now, I'm doing some fun problem solving. If you have watched any video of mine in the past, you probably see me addressing envelopes by hand. I send out a lot of letter mail through my Patreon and I address all the envelopes by hand, like uh, hundreds. And if my shop is open, even more. Um, so one of my patrons and an artist that I really admire reached out to me and showed me her method for printing addresses for envelopes on little labels, and I'm trying to figure that out for me. I've kind of not done it because I don't want the paper waste of the extra sticker to put on my envelope. When I can logically address it myself by hand and avoid that waste, but my hand hurts from addressing so many envelopes, so I think it's time um, I'm trying to figure out a way to be able to use my four by six labels that I can reci recycle the backing paper. Um, so I will have to cut them down and arrange the dresses on them, but at least I'll be able to recycle the back. So it, I don't know, I'm trying to figure it out. So wish me luck, I'm gonna need it. Please send help. still backlit, but not as bad, right? <laughs> Guys, I'm awesome. It's Thursday, I'm going to do a painting. I've been feeling really off my painting game because you know I haven't been, and that's why. I'm going to do Herc screaming, and I'm sorry about it. I'm going to do the still here, still life Instagram weekly photo prompt um, pick. I'm gonna use this as a reference and paint it. 
the Instagram's really neat and why the heck not, you know what I mean? So. just finished the gouache part of the painting so I'm just gonna let it dry and I use the extra paint to start some little tiny mini originals possibly for patreon that was fun I haven't painted upright since years um, that's definitely a lie um, I haven't painted upright on paper in years that's more true so it was fun you know when you're painting and like there happens to be a plum in the reference photo and you're like, I should eat a plum. Been there, dude. So reliable. the patreon postcard for the month but i hate i hate it now i like the original but i don't like the scanned version of it and i tried to kind of like make it work and i went on procreate and edited some stuff and i was like mm, i just don't love it i'm gonna wait on it and see if like i i decide if i hate it or love it you know did I show you the stamps I made yesterday? I made some new designs for a return address. Did I show you that? You've seen this before? I'm gonna do a self inking stamp for the um, return addresses now. I used to do stickers. Um, like this, I would print them out on my label printer and stick them on. But now that I wanna stick on addresses, I'm going to try and cut down on that paper waste by switching out my sticker labels and getting a stamp. And I also made a do not bend um, design because I've been using like a normal one I got on Amazon like 15 years ago. Made this guy, um, kind of love the frogs I drew. They're just really quick and easy and I love them and I'm zoomed in, am I zoomed in? Cool, cool. Here's the thing, this is what happened after this. This is why I'm giving you all this background info. I was really unsatisfied that I didn't have any of my Patreon designs done for my postcard and sticker rewards, but I was like, I'm gonna design the sticker now so I can be done with one of the designs. So this is what I did. 
I changed my do not bend guy into an I'm stinky guy. Um. <laughs> Can't decide if I hate this or not. I'm not gonna order it today. I'm gonna order it tomorrow. So I have a clear headspace. <laughs> I can't tell if I think it's funny or if it sucks. You ever been there before? Man, I have. So I'll check in tomorrow. Hey, what's up? It's Friday. Same spot, same girl, same, same work. Right now, this is what we're gonna do. Last time we spoke, you and me, uh, we looked at the sticker design I made that said I'm stinky. <laughs> I'm going to look at it now, see how I feel about it. I haven't looked yet, so this is gonna be a live reaction. Like I've never seen it before. So here we are on my iPad, going to procreate. Okay, I actually think it's cute. I think it's funny and cute. I think I'm gonna order it. Uh, here she is again. Let me focus this thing. Here she is. Um, I, I, do, I actually do think it's funny and cute. So, I think I'll order it. <laughs> I can feel why I wasn't sure yesterday because I still feel it a little bit now. But upon first reaction to this thing, I mean, you guys saw it. I thought it was kind of cute. Um, you see that? <sighs> you know? being unsatisfied with the I'm Stinky design. For my Patreon sticker, I decided to do two stickers for the reward this month, and I redrew the frog from the top of my address return design, and made this guy, and I'm gonna do this one really tiny, like little, and then I'll do the other design, like a medium size, and there'll be a little set of toads. Um, so just put those orders in so I have no turning back. I mean, I'm gonna cross it off my to-do list now. Watch me, dude. Watch me, I'm gonna cross it off right now. See? Boom, stickers, design, ordered. Uh, postcard on the other hand, not so sure. Not so sure. I think I'm going to try. <laughs> This is just a good spot for me to be squatting. I think I'm going to try and design my own font as a side note today. My legs are burning from this position. Why won't I move the camera? <laughs> as you know, I've been trying to print out my Patreon addresses onto labels so I don't have to write them so my hand doesn't fall off, which would be a pro for me. But I was talking about it with my friend Grace and she was like, hey, you can make your own font. And I was like, oh, oh, I can make my own font? Why didn't I think of that? So she sent me a little tutorial video and I'm going to try and make my own font so I can print my address labels with something that looks like my handwriting because I kind of miss the like personalized feel of it. Um, even though my stamps will both be my handwriting, I want it all to be my handwriting. Because it's all about me, baby. 
So I'm gonna try and make my own font. I'll link the video below of the tutorial that Grace sent me. And I'm gonna try and do it. I feel like it's gonna take me a while and I'm gonna probably mess it up and not do well, but the goal is to have the font regardless of how hard it is. Good luck to me. Low baby baby. I meant to type low baby font. Some of my symbols didn't um, import for some reason, but there it is. I mean, it looks kind of dumb. I specifically wanted the O like this. Uh, I don't know. I don't love it. I don't hate it. I do like the capital letters a lot more than I like the lowercase, which I also put in um, caps. I don't know, man. I did make a font, so that's pretty cool. Hello again. I've just been sorting more postcards, bagging them. I'm gonna bag up my mini red stickers. Working on um, getting this area organized to be like an inventory area, though I don't love it there because it's gonna be in the background of all my videos and it looks really um, full and a little hectic, um, but it's gonna be functional for packing orders, so I'm just gonna use it like that for now. Um, but I'm gonna close out this vlog. It's just a weekly vlog. It's been fun, guys. I haven't done a weekly vlog in... How long? Months? Years? Could be years. <laughs> you can stay updated on the progress of my shop update on my Instagram. I might post another vlog this month. Who knows? I'm trying to do a video every week. So I'll see you next week, I guess. Thanks for tuning in. If you liked this video, Give her a thumbs up. If you liked this video, give her a subscribe. I'm giving. Um, the red, red button I think would work fine. So I'll see ya. Bye.